the trademark pyrotechnical extravaganza of a Rammstein concert. The notorious German band has just released a new concert film called Rammstein Paris. Their shows are loud and provocative, but the band members looked relatively tame at the movie's world premiere in Berlin. It's a project they truly reveled in. For each new album, we try to come up with a show that will outdo the last one. And I think it's important to document that somehow, to capture the essence of what we were trying to do. In this case, it worked really well. We can show our grandkids what we were like on stage. <laughs> the film features footage from two concerts in Paris in 2012. 30 cameras were strategically placed to capture the band's mix of music, high-tech stage effects and theater. The film will be shown simultaneously in over 40 countries. It's always tricky trying to reproduce a live concert. I think that film is the only medium that can convey at least some of what we're doing. I like the slow-mos. A, we can't see ourselves on stage anyway. B, it's like watching a great goal in a football match. You can break it down into fractions of a second. And this is the man who put it all together, Swedish director Jonas Ukalund. The big challenge was to capture all those details and to go through the edit. It's a huge edit process to put it together and still have that impact and, you know, make it work on a small screen and, or, in this case, a big screen. But, you know, to translate the live uh, format into a film is, is hard. So we used every trick in the book to, to make a, a nice imprint. This is not Rammstein's first film. They were previously the subject of a 2015 documentary called Rammstein in America, which centered on the industrial metal band sellout show at New York's famous Madison Square Garden. The premiere of the new film was held at the Volksbühne Theater in Berlin. We asked the guys when we'd get to hear some new songs. We're working on a new album, and it's a lot of fun. We've had some wicked ideas. And the album will be out when it's out. That could take a while. In the meantime, fans can get their fill of their favorite band with Rammstein Paris.